We're going to learn some new stuff now. So we're going to learn stances first. The first stance we're going to learn is right stance. So to our right side, our back foot is facing to the right and our front foot is facing forward. Not much space between our legs. And this is simple right stance. We use this stance in our pattern that we've learned for this grading when we're doing our downward hammer strike at the start. We're in right stance, our back foot facing to the right. And just like the name, left stance is the same stance but to the left. It's our back foot pointing to the left, front foot pointing straight, heels are close together. So left stance and right stance, standing up nice and tall. So right stance and left stance. Okay, the blocks and strikes we're gonna learn. Downward hammer strike is the first one. So we're using our hammer fist. We're gonna do it to the side. So we're gonna go in right stance and we're gonna use our right hand and we're gonna use downward hammer strike. So we're coming up, bend arm and hammer strike down using the bottom of our fist to strike shoulder height. So if we do it in left stance, we're gonna use our left hand. Downward hammer strike. Again, right stance, right fist, downward hammer strike. The next one is turning elbow strike. So if we start in long stance, and we're gonna step forward using elbow strike, but we're gonna have our opposite hand in our fist, and do elbow strike. So this is turning elbow strike, meaning we've got our hand in our fist and we're turning our body as we do our elbow strike. So step forward, elbow strike. Change hands and step, elbow strike. This is turning elbow strike. And for the last one is target elbow strike. So now we're going to start in long stance, we're going to have a target out, have our hand out here. We're going to do elbow strike with our opposite arm. We're going to kick our hand where it is as a target. And we're going to reach our elbow out to touch our hand. So from here, target, elbow strike. Other stance, target, elbow strike. So now our fist is coming close to our chest. So our elbow is as long as it can get, hitting the target. So target, elbow strike. Target, elbow strike. And they're the strikes that you need to learn for your next grade. So now moving on to kicks. The first one is back kick. So if we start in fighting stance, we're gonna turn our body, face the back wall. We're gonna look over our left shoulder and kick with our left foot. We're going to go back, back kick, and land forward, and turn. So again, now I'm kicking with my back leg, my right leg. So I'm going to turn, face the back, look over my right shoulder, and back kick, and turn. Now I'm kicking with my left leg, so always kick with your back foot. I'm going to turn to the back, look over my left shoulder, kick with my left foot, and then turn. So make sure you turn after your kick. So now right leg, I'm kicking with my back foot. In fighting stance, I turn, look over my right shoulder and kick with my right leg. And my body stays facing the back wall. Kick, down, and then turn. One more time, I'm kicking with my back leg. I'm gonna turn, look, back kick, land, and then turn my body when I'm finished. And that's back kick. To do the next kick, which is spinning hook kick, it's the same action, I'm gonna turn, instead of doing back kick, I'm gonna hook my leg around face height. So again, fighting set, I'm gonna turn, kick with my back leg, I'm gonna hook, and land forward. So now my body is following my leg. So as I spin, my body is spinning at the same time as my leg. So again, fighting stance, I'm kicking with my back leg. So I turn to the back, 
Now as I kick, my body turns and I make a hook action with my foot to the face and I land forward. Again, kick with my back leg, so I turn, hook, land forward. And that's spinning hook kick. So our body is turning with our kick and landing forward. And the last one we're doing is spinning roundhouse kick. So from fighting stance, the last kick is going to be a roundhouse kick, which is what we've done a lot. Our back foot is going to come behind our body. And we're going to land forward and then roundhouse kick. So again, our back foot comes behind our body and we spin straight and then roundhouse kick. To practice, you might find a line on the floor. Start on the line and try and step onto the line with your back foot. So you travel straight and then kick. It's important that you keep your balance. So start slow, get the technique right before you start to try a bit faster and harder. So again, fighting stance, our back foot turns and kick. We're turning behind our body, towards our back. Turn, ready, kick. And then you can do it a bit faster. Kick. And that's spinning roundhouse kick. So good luck with all your new techniques, all your new stances, kicks, blocks and strikes. And continue to train hard and you'll get closer to your black belt in no time.